All right, we are on the Asia Pacific. We're in the Sakura Hills, hole five, bar four. Okay, so I'm gonna use a quasar. I'm not really interested in ending up out there in that rough. Three nine, so four per ring, a little shy of two rings. It's two point one per ring. Hit it great to the right, which took out that little teeny bit of curl I put in it. A little short of where I would have liked to have been. <clears throat> if I play this, so if this hole comes up in a tournament, and the tournaments that it's been in, I don't have them recorded. I was on the road and didn't have time to record and post videos and stuff, so I just shot the rounds. But... Uh, I would figure out exactly. It takes two point two and a half top spin or four and a half top spin or whatever it happens to be. We'd figure that number out. So when you came here, you'd be a lot closer to the to the rough up there, but still be in the game maybe ten yards off. I'm never interested in pushing my luck or my limit because that right there sucks. The other thing about our opponent's line is, is that their line Alright, so we have our guardian, max backspin. I'm not going to be able to get super close to it from this angle, so I'm just going to shoot it. That's 2 4. I'm going to do a 2.5 rank pull. Isn't it perfect? And just get on the green. I see a lot of people end up in the in the rough right here. The wind adjustment here is a little is a little tricky and you the the problem with hitting in the front where our opponent's at is it's on that hillside. And I'm not if you watch my videos, I'm I'm not a big fan of hitting on hillsides. There's only one hole where we do a rough bump where we hit off of a hillside because I see that right there happen all the time. And I'm not interested in getting involved in that. But the hillside that we do that rough bump on is not as steep as this. I'm, I'm not a big fan of these. Get in a hole. I want to shoot these par threes. Come on. Now, if he chips that in to win, I might be irritated. <laughs> these are those holes where you play them. I haven't played these holes in a long time, so going through them and just remembering, once again, it's remembering the drive and then starting to dial in the approach shot. If we're playing these holes in a tournament, if you were watching me do the Monday practice round, I'm all over the place because I'm just really trying to figure out. I just want to make sure I have a locked in drive and what ball I'm going to use. And then, then I go for the what I need for the approach based on where I could get, oh, excuse me, where I can get with my drive. This is a low percentage eagle hole. So getting eagle on this hole is a big deal. But there's also, I, there's going to be a lot of people that are going to end up with pars on this hole. So what 
It's as easy as what our opponent did.